We're Tampa RV show virgins. Obviously, we're in the long line already. First mistake. I don't know if that's a mistake or not. I just think we're a little bit late <laughs> coming to the party. <laughs> we're ready to check out the Tampa RV show. entrance to the big expo where you get more of your class A, more expensive buses and recreational vehicles. And then we'll get an opportunity to take you outside. I'm anxious. I've never been to this. This is pretty cool. So I'm anxious to go outside and see all the vendors that are going to be set up. up to the bedroom and bathroom. Mm -hmm. Very cool. It's a huge kitchen. Huge. Massive TV, TV fireplace. That's pretty sweet. Perfect for movie night right there. Movie Big bottle of wine. Chairs. <laughs> Somebody's already drank the wine though. We're both of <laughs> Yeah, I think there's down there. Yeah, if you want space, <laughs> these fifth wheels are massive. Massive with space, especially if you're traveling with a big family. Now here is something way different. Different layout for a fifth wheel. You got basically your entire living room in the back beautiful entertainment center area. A ton of sofas. This is pretty tricky. Movie theater up here. Yeah. The slides. Just a little bit what? different. Of a, it's a little different. It's mm -hmm. high end. Oh, I really like this little accent where you kind of got your own like little kitchen caged in with another TV. Lots of storage space if you like to cook and you like to entertain. It's a great kitchen. Very cozy. Really, really have gotten some cool light fixtures now and accents and lighting inside. So if you don't want everything so open, this might be a fifth wheel design where it's more compartments. You know what I mean? Like more rooms separated. A little bit more coziness, I think. I like it. Still got a nice big bathroom and a nice big shower. Yeah. These have come a long way. Pretty spectacular. So we were just showing you the landmark fifth wheel. This is Big Country. And different price point, a little less expensive, 86000 But I'm going to tell you what, the space is massive still. Look at this. Look at the space underneath it. It's the same way as the one you just did. Mm -hmm. Still got the theater seating. Gigantic. It might not be quite as expensive as leather. Kitchen might have been a little bit bigger. But I mean, I just love the islands that they put in these. Look at this pantry. Ooh, nice. Full size refrigerator. Bath. And notice, I mean, not everything is utilized. I mean, storage, storage, storage. There's nothing unturned. 
bathroom. Even under the bed, you have to shower with a seat. Very nice. Big closet. Big closet. Hell, you could sleep in there. More closet space. <laughs> What they are doing with buses right now is just insane. It's got more canvas going out. Having a major apartment. This is probably bigger than most apartments actually in New York City. I'm done. <laughs> get the, start to get sore feet? Never wear these type of shoes. To the you RV would think show. at almost 50 years old she would have that figured out by now. I thought they'd be comfortable. I'm also starving, and there is a ton of food out there, but my feet hurt too much to go back out there. But I will say this if you are looking for anything to do with a RV, bus, motorhome, Airstream, a, camper, a, truck a, camper, you're looking for parks, you're looking parks. for apps. You're looking for accessories, you're looking for even, they've had jewelry cleaners, they've had... <laughs> I think this is the largest RV show in the country, I believe. Uh, I, I well, somebody told me that. it's massive. So, we did a, a few little video tour for you, and hopefully you guys will enjoy what we were able to gather for you. But I can tell you, we picked up a lot of good ideas to feature on RV Roundup yep. for the future. Thank mm -hmm. you.